Hello stampers! My name is Linda Bettinger and I'm an independent Stamping Up demonstrator in Denver, Colorado. I have been offline for a very long time and I have received many, many wonderful inquiries of people saying they missed my videos and when was I going to be back and am I okay and all kinds of concern generated to my team. Somebody actually reached out to my son um, and I apologize for being so um, distant. Uh, as many of you know, my dearest friend in the world uh, was very ill um, and given um, a short time to live. And she did pass away in September, late September, and um, doesn't have any family. She's the closest thing to a sister I've had and we've been friends for 50 years. Um, now, my friend Lori uh, didn't have any family left and designated me to be her personal representative. So I found that caring for her while she was alive since about June until she passed in September really took up most of my time following her to doctors and making sure that she was um, properly caring for herself. Um, and it's been, it's been quite a difficult period of time for me, uh, following on the heels of two years ago losing my husband. So two very important people in my life gone. Um, and uh, Lori uh, was the kind of person that kept pretty much everything. And so going through her things and clearing her household and um, getting bequests to different people. She had a lot of art and a lot of beautiful antique furniture and getting all of that stuff processed has taken up virtually all of my time. And so I haven't posted a video or made a card or even been in my craft room. In fact, looking behind me, you see it looks very different. Um, I also chose during this time to move my craft room from the lower level of my house to uh, the main level so that the running up and down the stairs is a little less cumbersome for me. Um, why I chose to do it at this exact time is still a mystery, um, but it's done and uh, I'm not sure everything's in the right place yet, but it's all up here. Um, I just wanted to come on and assure you all that I am just fine. Tired, um, having um, gone through the process of preparing her house and putting it up for sale and it's now under contract and Hopefully we'll be closing in the next couple of weeks um, and that will give me back most of my life again. I'm really looking forward to having my craft room moved, having had an opportunity to look through everything um, and um, reorganize. Uh, I'm really excited about the Stampin' Up! new catalog uh, that's coming out. Um, years from me will be delayed a little bit, but I'll have them out for you here uh, within the next couple of weeks. Um, I'm really looking forward to getting back in the craft room and I've got a couple of paper pumpkins that are sitting here uh, haunting me. <laughs> so I will be getting to those things and making cards and getting back into uh, putting uh, postings up weekly and everything right after the first of the year. But I wanted to come on and say thank you all for your concern, your kind words, and to wish each and every one of you the happiest of holidays. It's a, My world has a little big hole in it right now, uh, but fortunately my family is here and so I have an opportunity to uh, have a, a, a very good holiday. And I hope that you and yours have a wonderful holiday, however you celebrate it. And my plan is to be back right after the first of the year. Um, and maybe we'll start with a paper pumpkin and kind of ease into it. Um, 
So I just, I just wanted to come on and say again, happy holidays and I'm fine. Thanks again for your attention and concern for me. I, it, very touching. I am so lucky. I've got the best subscribers in the world, the best customers in the world, and a team that rivals none. And so, uh, so I, I am just very, very lucky. Um, and so I wanted to come on and at least pass this message along and assure you that things are fine, uh, getting back to normal, and I'll be back with regular videos shortly after the first of the year. Bye now. Have a great holiday. Bye.